Welcome back to another Run Bike Mike video. My name is Mike and this is a one-up roof rack. Today, my buddy Chad and I are gonna try to install this on the top of my camper shell. And we took the camper shell off my truck. Why? Eh, it's just so much easier. Let's get to it. First step to install this is to flip over the one-up rack and use the bolts that were provided in the package to slide through the channel. Then you can place the brackets in place. Next, just put on the locking nut, but don't tighten it down all the way as you'll probably have to readjust the brackets to get it lined up with the top of your roof rack. All right, so what we've done so far, you guys saw we put this little piece on, on both sides over there, and then we slid inside these channels on top of the roof rack, these little kind of brass looking pieces and they're going to connect in to right here. And then these bolts right here will just screw into the top of that. So literally we are almost done and I think it's been a total of five minutes. Now we're ready to flip it over and see if we've got it lined up right. In this particular case, we needed to adjust it just a little bit as we kind of suspected whenever we were putting the brackets on. Simply just flip it back over, make sure that you've got it aligned right, and then tighten down the locking nuts. After you've done that, you can flip it back over. And now that you've got it properly lined up, you can simply just use the last four bolts that came with the rack and tighten it down. It's that easy. This rack was incredibly simple to install. Now this install is the flush mount version that we did, but you can also get three different type of standard mounts, a one inch, a one and a half inch, and a two inch bolt size, along with a low clearance two inch bolt size. So there are several different options, all depending on your roof rack style. All right, Chad is trying to maneuver my gigantic bike out of the tiniest spot ever, and he did a good job. We're gonna see how he does with installing this bike for the very first time. Get over here where I can see them. So this is the first time you've used a one-up rack, right, Chad? Yes, I've watched videos. Okay. This is my first now granted, this will be up on the roof of your camper. It will be a little bit more difficult, but not, not too much more difficult. That's it. That was incredibly easy. Yeah. We literally, so we literally installed the bike rack on the roof and installed the bike probably total time, maybe, maybe 10, 15 minutes. Okay, so I'm gonna try to unload this. He's got it partially unloaded here, but uh, you'll just lift up on these levers, lower that bar back away from the bike. And then this one, just roll it forward. There we go. God, you're a genius, Chad. So yeah, that's how you, that's how you would do it. It's pretty easy, man. That's incredibly easy. All right, now let me try to load it on. Wow, I'm impressed. That's good, yeah. I'm really impressed. Yeah. I have to say I'm very impressed with the machine quality that is on a one-up rack. This is the first time I've ever seen one up close and personal. And the anodized aluminum looks incredible, along with the powder coat base where your wheels set. Looks like this thing is gonna be durable for a very long time. If you have any trouble with it at all, these racks do come with a lifetime warranty and you can buy any type of replacement part for them at any time and put it on yourself. Super impressive. Now this rack is completely adjustable, all the way from a 29 inch tire down to a 16. However, 1UP made this really nice, where the top position is made for 26, 27.5, 29, and 700 C. So most of your standard bikes will fit in that one position. But if you need to, you can always adjust it later. The roof rack only weighs about 14 pounds and folded up only stands 2.5 inches tall. This is going to be a really good option for a lot of people who are looking for something that's compact, but is going to be very durable. So there you go. That's our initial thoughts and review and first time setup, first time install, first time ever using a one-up rack at all. First time for me for ever using a rack that's like this, where it folds up against the tires. How about you? Same. Yeah. So 
As you can see, this rack is extremely easy to use. If you're gonna have a roof rack, you've had two different versions now, and I don't know about your last one, seemed like it wasn't as quick and easy to use. This one seems like it's super fast. No matter what roof rack you have, it's, it's still difficult, but I think this is a really cool setup. I can't wait to try it out on your camper to see what it's like lifting these bikes up six feet in the air, however tall your camper is. Yeah, so if you guys uh, like this video, give it a thumbs up. Uh, have you ever used a one-up rack? Specifically, have you used a one-up roof rack? What did you think of it? And if you haven't already subscribed, go ahead and subscribe. It really helps out the channel. But as always, get out there, run, bike, build. Just have fun. We'll see you in the next one. Sick rack, bro.